pretty cool. And so th their first idea was that, you know, have them live in one of these. Yeah. You know? but, Very cool. So then you take a shift and they take a shift. How well, many different there's people? Some, there's four of us that are completely not related to the school. I mean, the gardener. Is one, one of the goat milkers. Well, hello. You're kind of Nubian. That's short, man. Who's pregnant. Is she Nubian? Uh, um, the, the brown one is Nubian. The black mm. and white one is a mix of alpine, boar, and Nubian. Mm. Like your face. Yes, I like your face. I used to have a French alpine goat named Baby the Good Goat. So that's why she has those airplane ears that uh -huh. stand out rather than... Down. down, right. I had an alpine, and she had big ears. She was a huge goat, she, and she gave a gallon every day, wow. which was a huge amount. But I worked at a produce market, so I get she ate really high on the hog, on the produce. She had all these boxes of produce every day. Very cool, Heidi. So how long have the goats lived here? You're lucky goats. Look at this stunning view. The goats are here at the Waldorf School where kids probably come and play out there. You guys well, love it. Built this from it's great. It's great. This is exactly their cool environment. And they probably totally love having kids come over here. Yeah. They have friends. Mm-hmm.